Hello plant lovers and welcome to a quick seed sowing edition. I'm just going to sow a couple of seeds with you. First we're starting off with some home saved red bell pepper. I just want to just almost just see how these go more out of curiosity than actually needing them. So let's do a couple of these. Oops. I think I've already dropped a seed. There's too many. <laughs> Don't need that many. So I'm just going to do a few in here, maybe three. And we're just more to experiment more than anything. Okay, so we'll try three of those. Okay, so I'm just going to pop that one in there. Next, we will do. Some leeks. So here I'm just um, going to sprinkle some of the seeds um, sparingly in two of these pots. Of course remembering to label and I actually made these labels out of milk bottles so I just recycled milk bottles and cut them up and finally in the last three containers I'm just going to um, sow some spring onions as I've seen everybody else do this so I just thought I'd join the bandwagon I've actually also sowed aubergines and some um, sweet peppers, but they're taking so long to germinate, so I didn't include them in this video, but hopefully I'll be sharing um, that video with you soon once they do germinate. So here I'm just showing off my homemade labels. So I'd already watered the compost before putting the seeds in and I just topped it off with some compost on top. And it's actually sitting in an old croissant box that I've got. So I'm literally going to pick that up and put it on a heated mat. Okay, so here we are uh, one week later. And as you can see, these have been on a heat mat. And more or less everything's germinated. Um, so the for the bell peppers just there they only one has germinated mm. but this was home safe seed anyway and the spring onions have all like germinated and kind of bent over and some leeks have come up i didn't put that many leeks in as i remember so not bad now the real challenge is just going to be how do we keep these alive with such low light so what I'm going to do is I am going to move them to um, the bedroom window and hopefully they'll have enough light uh, to sustain them. So they've just been on a heat mat with this lid closed. But now because the uh, spring onions are so long, I'm going to have to take them out of this thing or just leave it open in the window. So that's just a, a little germination update um just to show share progress and that's it for now so um if you haven't already please show your love and subscribe and take care until next time